9-11 was more than 20 years ago, and Southwest Virginia is paying tribute to those who lost their lives that tragic day. Ted News reporter Keisha Lane breaking down where some other events are happening today. Keisha, there are several of them. That's absolutely right, and one event is taking place at the National D-Day Memorial. It's hosting its annual wreath-laying ceremony with the help of the Bedford Fire Department. The fire department says they've been doing this at the National D-Day Memorial for about 50 years. Between 40 to 50 people show up to remember the people who died on 9-11. Chief Todd Stone with the Bedford Fire Department says it's important to participate in the ceremony at the National D-Day Memorial because it directly affects first responders. We promised then that we would never forget and uh, we won't as firefighters and first responders and we will uh, uh, remember them uh, every year. And we just hope that our citizens, especially those that wasn't born then, that remember that and understand the history. Stone says he was in Roanoke working with its fire department when 9-11 happened. He says the governor put them all on call just in case there were other attacks that day. There are also other events taking place throughout Southwest Virginia today. Just a few include a remembrance formation at 715 this morning by the Virginia Tech Corps of Cadets. At 830, the Danville Fire Department is hosting its 23rd commemoration ceremony and VMI is hosting its annual stair climb around 4 p.m. For a full list of locations and the times for the memorial events, you can go to our website at WSLS.com. Keisha Lynn, 10 News working for you.